Okay, so some of the basic terminology that we'll be using and it will be repeated, so it's good to know, is the group head, the group handle, the group basket, uh, the lugs, the spouts, um, the shower screen, which is up inside the group head, the steam wand, is there, or the steam arm, it's also called. So the grinder has the hopper, which when we take it off, we can look down inside at the conical blades. The electronics panel, which lights up when we turn on the on off button down here. We've got the cloth, a nice dry tea towel to, for wiping out the handle, so it's nice and clean. The tamper, our 30 mil measuring cup for measuring the 30 mil shot. The timer for measuring the 30 second shot. On the electronics panel, uh, we've got the, the double button, which is for our double handle and we press it to see how much coffee we've got coming through. So it hasn't quite filled the basket, so we, I know I want to program this to have more coffee coming through. So to adjust the dose, I hold down the menu button until it flashes, press the double button, and I can see there it says 4.5 seconds. And so that's how many seconds the grinder will grind for. If I want more coffee to come through, I just need to press the plus button and adjust it up to, I'm going to adjust it up to five seconds so that I know I'll get more coffee coming through when I press the double button again this time. So to adjust the grind, we'll need to pull it our first shot. So, tamping nice and evenly, lock our handle in and use the measuring cup to measure 30 mil and start our timer. It's a fairly pale extraction so we know it's way too fast at the moment so we'll need to adjust the grind. We just make a bit of an adjustment which brings the, the, the blades of the grinder closer together. So we'll get smaller particles of coffee. Distribute the grind, a nice even tamp. So that shot's coming through a lot darker. It's got some really beautiful caramel color. And stopping it just before that 30 mil, it's at 29 seconds, which is close enough. Packing up the grinder at the end of the day, first of all we need to put the coffee into a resealable bag. We don't want to leave it in the hopper because it will sit there getting stale. We can use the steam wand just to give us enough moisture to wipe out the inside of the hopper. Make sure we get rid of all the moisture because we don't want water dripping down into the the blades. We just grind out what's left in the grinder. We don't want beans sitting in the burrs overnight. You can hear when there's no longer any coffee in the burrs and turn it off. And that's it. Three key points to remember about setting the grind. Number one, 30 mils in 30 seconds is the guide for an optimum extraction. Number two, consistent dosing of the basket from one shot to the next. And number three, keep cleaning. Making coffee makes a mess and it is more efficient to tidy as you go than to work in a mess. It also makes it easier at the end of the day.